morning. Thank you for having me. My name is Suzanne Prince. I'm a South Georgia native who has proudly called Valdosta and Lowndes County my home for the past 10 years. During this time, I've had the opportunity to serve my community in many different capacities. I'm an active member of the Valdosta Junior Service League. I serve as board secretary for the Greater Valdosta United Way. I'm a trustee of the South Georgia Medical Center Foundation Board. I serve as board president for Tennis Valdosta Community Tennis Association. I'm a member of the Valdosta Lounge Parks and Recreation Authority. And I'm a volunteer youth soccer coach, just to name a few. Because of my involvement in so many different areas, I've witnessed firsthand how SLOS dollars affect the lives of our local citizens on a daily basis. SLOS has been ensuring quality growth in our community for the past 25 years. Since inception, voters have wisely decided to profit from the dollars spent by those visiting our community. Now we benefit from daily projects and, and improvements throughout Valdosta and Lowndes County that have been funded one penny at a time. SLOS is a tax that we can actually see. We can see where the money is being spent to specifically benefit people in our community. Whether I'm playing tennis at Mackey Park, coaching soccer at Bolleton Park, attending an event at the James H. Rainwater Conference Center, parking in the new parking facility at South Georgia Medical Center, traveling through Valdosta Regional Airport, or simply commuting, commuting through Lowndes County on safe streets and highways, I personally benefit from, from SLOS funded projects each and every day. As a voter, community volunteer, and parent, I've taken a personal interest in SLOS and the projects that it will fund in, the in our community in the future. What I've come to realize is that our local elected officials have taken great care in developing a list of projects that will continue to improve infrastructure, encourage economic development, and enhance the quality of life for those who choose to call our, com our community their home. As the SLOT 7 campaign moves forward, I encourage each and every voter to take an active role, as I have, in researching the impact of SLOT's funding in our community. I'm confident that you will all discover a wealth of completed projects that would more than likely still be on the drawing floor board had it not been for SLOT's funding. When our current sports facilities have proven to generate over 1,000 local hotel room nights over the course of just one weekend, I can only imagine what the addition of more complexes can do for our community. Not only are these people sleeping in our hotels, but they're eating in our restaurants, they're buying fuel from our gas stations, they're shopping with our local merchants, they are spending their dollars in our town. Our community was not named Title Town USA by mere chance. We like to win. We like to win at everything that we set out to accomplish. When compared to other area local communities, I would say that Valdosta and Lowndes County are winning so far. But remember, the game's not over. We can't quit. In closing, I would like to remind you that a penny truly does make a difference. And I invite each of you to vote yes with me on November 6th for slot 7. Thank you.